Hello and welcome to uh, Living Life with Purpose. I'm your host, Phil Foster. The Apostle Paul said in Philippians chapter 3, these words, he said, I press toward the prize of the high calling that's in Christ Jesus. And in your walk of faith, it's many times referred to as a journey, a race, whatever. Uh, these are all images that God uh, had painted on the pages of Scripture to remind us of how the journey would be. In other words, Paul said, I press toward the mark for the prize. In your walk of faith, there are going to be many, many things during the course of life that are going to try to hold you back or going to try to hinder you and keep you from being all you can be for God and, and doing God's best that He has planned for your life. In Jeremiah 29, the Bible says God has plans for us, plans to bless us and prosper us. And all that isn't just so we can sit around and uh, feel good, but God has a work for every one of us. He has, he has a plan and a purpose for you being on planet Earth. And the way that we're able to do what God's called us to do is to stay focused on what God has given us as an assignment. Leo Tolstoy once said, Everyone thinks of changing the world, and I'll summarize what he said, when they need to start a change themselves. The first thing you're going to have to have happen if you're going to reach the prize that God has for you is to let God change you. Now, none of us are perfect. We've all got shortcomings. We've all got warts or whatever. But, you know, just allow God to do His work in you as you spend time in the Bible and prayer when you hear a message. Uh, allow God to speak to you and make those changes in our life. And then just keep on keeping on. Uh, life's not always filled with victory. Sometimes we all experience the agony of defeat. But in the end, the Bible said a righteous man falls seven times and he gets back up. So the key today isn't how well you start the race, but it's how well you finish the race. And I don't know how you feel, but I want to run this race uh, with 100% of my effort. And I, one day I'm going to finish the race. And I want to hear God say, well done, thou good and faithful servant, to me one day. Well, I'm all out of time for today, so till we get together tomorrow, may God bless you. And hey, have a great day.